Hi, I'm Emily. I'm what we call an analyst, and I work here at the Criminal Intelligence Unit at BCI. In CIU, we do all sorts of things like collect and organize information in criminal cases. So, in this case, we have Bob's cell phone records. You guys should have those in front of you. With those cell phone records and statements from the suspects, we're able to create a timeline of the events that happened. On October 23rd, Tara Agriculture leaves town to visit her grandchildren at 4 p.m. At 8.30 p.m., Bob Agriculture checks his barn and secures it for the night. At 11.30 p.m., Wantu texts Maya, night, his phone is in the vicinity of Bob's cell phone tower. At 8.03 a.m., Maya texts Bob asking to meet to discuss their disagreement about the ownership of the farm. At 9.01 a.m., Bob shares with Maya a threatening text message that he receives from Ash Ball about his dog, Buckeye. At 6.45 p.m., Tara comes home and is not able to locate Bob or his dog, Buckeye. At 7.10 p.m., Tara calls the police to report Bob is missing. So, another tool we use in a case like this is called a link chart. A link chart helps to show exactly how everyone's related in a case. In this case, Bob is married to Tara, Buckeye is Bob's dog. Maya is Bob's sister. She's also in a relationship with Wantu. Wantu is an acquaintance of Bob's. And both Organic Joe and Ash Ball are Bob's neighbors. All of this information helps us to organize the complicated facts of a case.